now let's try to understand the question in this question you have to provide you an input if your input is 5 n is equal to 5 you need to display like this this is the pattern you need to display in the first line one star in the second line two stars in the third line three stars in the fourth line four stars in the fifth line five stars this is what you need to display suppose if your n is equal to 6 if your input is 6 you need to display sixth line six stars if your input is 10 tenth line ten stars that is what you need to display so now coming to the intuition part understand it properly suppose if you want to display star display star display star display star display star the same code if you want to repeat you need a loop so if you want to display one line we are using a loop for j in the range of 1 comma what value we need to fill here that's the question you keep in your mind you'll get clarity soon so which value we need to fill here so assume that we have filled with value 5 means this loop is going to execute five times it go inside print star print star print star print star it is going to fill the line with five stars so the point you need to understand this piece of code is used to display one line okay now the same code repeat same code repeat same code repeat third line same code repeat fourth line same code repeat fifth line means this piece of code if you place it in in a loop that is what nested loop is but the point you need to understand for the first time if you execute this loop this loop has to execute one time because it has to display only one star second time when you execute this code it has to this loop has to execute two times third time when you execute this code this loop has to execute three times means this value is dynamic how we are going to control that that is the point you need to get clarity in the coding hope you got good intuition about uh, how to write the code 